Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are back at it again with another Shein haul. But this time, this is actually a Shein shoes and purses haul. I have a couple of shoes that I got off of Shein. And here I am today to show you guys what I got. So, without further ado, we're going to get into the video. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel if you are new. And turn on the notification bells for new videos every single Monday and throughout the week. So, let's get started. So, the first pair of shoes that I have are these two heels right here. These, I believe, are called the Dorothy heels, something of that nature. But, of course, I will have the actual title of the heels on the screen for you guys and also in the description box below. But, here they are. They are these sage green heels, which I am so in love with. I feel like these heels really give, like, summer. Like, I feel like they are summer in a whole nutshell i feel like green is really like the major like summer color like i feel like if you got some green boom you got summer you know because grass is greener during summer everything is bright colorful so yeah i really am doing something more on that theme since we are in summer right now it's summer 2021 the size for these shoes are a seven and a half and um the fit of these shoes are literally perfect so i'm really excited that i got my exact size and it fits as it should these are super duper comfortable they're also extremely gorgeous might i add they look exactly like the picture which i think is really good because a lot of the times the, the, the shoes they don't be looking like their pictures and that just really disturbs my spirits but these actually look like their picture so i think that's awesome like i really do and then that's how like the bottom of it look it's like that beigey color and then that's the inside that is like the soles and everything of it and then i love how this part right here is like ruffled i think that that's a really cute touch it gives you kind of like that dainty sort of feel in my opinion i love it i really do and i know that these are going to be one of my faves i actually got some green shorts so i already know that i'm going to pair those shorts with these heels right here because these heels are literally like a perfect match and i also got a couple of green dresses so these heels will definitely be getting worn so make sure you guys follow me on instagram so you guys can see all my cute little summer pics that i'm gonna be flicking up my instagram is in the um description box down below these also have the little square toe right here which i love uh, i know a lot of people are not really a fan of the square toe but i am and this is not the type of square toe where your toes are going to be over the edge my toes were literally inside the shoe and they stayed there i was walking around in it just a little bit um and they stayed there so if you guys are kind of like concerned about that with square toes i don't think you have to worry about it with these but of course that is like subjective because if you got some really long toes then you know things might change up a little bit with that but <laughs> if you have pretty regular average toes i don't think that they will be slipping out of these shoes so i think that these have a really comfortable fit i could definitely see me walking around in these all day and not really having you know much of an issue um i love the heel right here itself is not very steep um that also can like add to like a shoe being uncomfortable but the heel right here is actually very like natural like it's like a natural flow and i don't even have an arch in my foot i am very much so flat footed and these just really have like a natural flow to it so i think that that is actually um really good to note to you guys and yeah these are really comfortable fit like i honestly have no complaints about these and i'm really excited because these were the shoes that i was the most excited for when i was ordering these and they are literally as is they are giving what i needed to be gave and girl yes yeah. so anyways um we're gonna move on to the next heel but these are def a keeper and i would definitely recommend this to you guys if you guys are looking for some shoes in this you know realm they also have tons of other colors so make sure you guys click the links down below so you guys can get some of these items that i am going to show you so the next pair of shoes that i have are these very very much so cute and um you know risque um uh crocodile print um or alligator print oh my god i don't know which print it is crocodile or alligator you be the judge i kind of forgot but um but they are these croc print heels in brown and i really thought that these heels were super cute i thought they were definitely different um i do have like a lot of brown like in my wardrobe so i was like you know what i don't really need any more brown heels but i'll go ahead and just add another brown heel pair of brown heels because these are just so freaking cute to me like i don't usually go for heels who have like the point i kind of hate that but i saw some pictures of people wearing it and i just really was like 
think Instagram, think, think, think aesthetic. And I felt like these would be a really cute kind of like, you know, just a little kind of like feature like with the outfit. I think that these would definitely like bring it out or could add to like the character of it. But the thing with this is me being a huge dum-dum, okay? Me being the silly little rabbit that I am. I didn't order not one pair of these, but I ordered two. So I have two pairs of the same freaking heels. I don't think y'all know how mad I was when um, <laughs> I, I, I noticed that when I got this in it's two pairs of shoes because that was literally not my intention at all. And I'm also mad because that means that I could have gotten a different pair of heels um, because I had like a limit with like the spending and I'm just so mad like I ordered two pairs of shoes but I will be putting these on my Poshmark so if you guys have Poshmark make sure you guys follow me on there I will be linking my Poshmark here on the screen so you guys can go follow me on there and buy these shoes if you want to buy them because yeah um, yeah girl I don't know but anyways back to the review um, so I put these heels on of course I had to try them off for you guys and these fit really 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 nice like i honestly don't have any complaints um it is a little different like the feel of it was a little different but it wasn't uncomfortable i don't feel like this is gonna be uncomfortable at all it feels fairly sturdy but if i bring this up a little closer to you guys you guys might be able to notice that that is completely like plastic which again this is shein like this these heels i think was only like 15 dollars and some change so you get what you pay for period but i think it'll still be a cute i think it's cute for photos that's really why i got it i thought that this would be really cute for photos like i'm thinking like a dinner or something outside of a restaurant i don't know but we'll see but um i thought this was cute like it just kind of gave me new york fashion week vibes like you know so i went ahead and purchased them i put them on and they actually fit pretty comfortable uh my toes stayed inside of the shoe and um there wasn't really much wobbling when I was walking in them. I think I walked in them pretty smoothly, which is nice. Again, this one has a really nice heel, heel to like foot toe transition right here. Because with some heels, like the heels that I got from Ego Shoes, if you haven't seen my Ego Shoe haul, then make sure you guys watch that. Link is right here. But um, my Ego Shoes, they have a very steep heel. Like they start like up here and then they dip like that and that can also add to like you know uncomfortability like when you're like wearing the shoe so i love how it's smooth like it's like a smooth transition boom boom right there like that's gonna add to it being more comfortable for sure and like i said i don't got no arch in my foot so i need smooth i need smooth <laughs> i'm pretty I'm, I'm really happy that i got this though and it looks exactly like the picture and i can bring this up just a little bit closer if you guys want to see exactly how the crock print looks but that is it and i think that you could also wear this in fall too so fall's coming up fall is right after summer so yeah you gotta you know you gotta be prepared like you got to, you got to, you got to. And I got these in a size 8 because people were saying that you have to like round size up or whatever. And these were like a perfect size. Typically I'm a 7.5 so um, I think that that would be accurate. I do think you may need to size up with these. But again that is like subjective but um, they're a size um, 38 in European sizing if you guys are wondering. And I'm pretty sure that that is a size 8 but if it's not... I'm gonna look stupid so <laughs> but yes I'm pretty sure it's a size 8 um yeah we're gonna go ahead and move on okay I just wanted to say really quickly though before I move on um I'm looking back at my order details and it says that I got the croc heels in a size 7 which I'm usually a seven and a half, so you guys want to size down and not up so I hope that helps uh, so size down not up because I kept saying up is down so yes Okay, so here is the next pair of heels that we got. We got these brown, cute little strappy um, heels right here. These are called the faux leather ankle strap stiletto heel. And these are in a size 7.5. And, and these are another pair of like brown sort of like heels. They kind of, they kind of sort of give you a little bit of an orange like hint or tint, whatever, but... These are like more so on the brown family, I think. These are a really light 
brown but I thought that these were really cute these are one of those like pretty trendy styles on Instagram that I'm seeing a lot um, I'm seeing a lot with the with the you know square heel square toe and then the strap and so I really wanted to go ahead and just get one of these and um, these actually fit pretty good the only issue with these were that the the strap right here it was just a just a little bit loose on me but I don't think it was like that noticeable I also could have probably if I add another like nook in the strap right here I think it might be a little bit tighter but we'll see I didn't want to I didn't want to do it just yet because I don't like to make impulse decisions but I'm thinking I might have to add like another little nook in the um in the strap to add for like a hole but other than that though I think the shoes were really cute I think they fit pretty good on me minus what I just mentioned to you guys they feel nice honestly like they feel they have like that it's supposed to be like a faux leather that's what it said and I would agree the heel even this part right here it's even like that same texture, which is nice. Consistency is always nice. I don't have really many complaints. Um, I just really thought that these would be like cute because you know these are like really like trending for real for real on like Instagram and like social media period. Like I just keep seeing this sort of style, so I'm like, let me just go ahead, hop on the wave. So I gotta hurry up and wear these though because summer is almost over. Like I'm actually getting scared, but. I just, I'm gonna just have to flick it up, like, I'm gonna just have to flick it up, but I'm gonna do that after I get my eyelash extensions, but, yeah, I think these are really cute, they're nice, um, they fit pretty good, my toes did not slip to the top, and I would say that the fit is pretty accurate, um, I think that, yeah, I think it was accurate, I think I had a little bit of space right here, which to me is good, you always want to have space in your heel, I don't think you ever want it to be like, literally your, your your foot is sitting like right there so i think that having a little space in the back is good if it's a problem for you though then maybe size down i think um but i don't think that'll be an issue for me at all okay so these are the next heels that i got off the site they are um a little bit different they have like this netting right here um this black netting but i don't know if you guys have been seeing like there's like these heels by um who was it? Bottega Veneta? How you say it? Bottega Veneta. And they make like these heels with like the netting. But it's actually like all around right here. And I saw these. And I thought that this would be cute. Um, I know that it's black and summer it should be color. But hear me out. It has netting. So think about like the beach. Think about like taking a vacation to like Mykonos. You got like a cute black dress. Maybe even like, I don't know, another color because these are black. Boom. Here you go. Here you go. Like, netting just kind of gives me like vacation vibes. And, you know, summer is like the season of vacation. So, I just kind of wanted to go ahead and get these just for aesthetics sake. But, um, I don't think these are going to be like an everyday shoe for me. But these would definitely be like a statement shoe like for pictures, you know, just to be like different or whatnot. But these are called the, um, mesh panel meal sandals and these are in a size 7 which is a european 38 and um they fit me pretty freaking well and they also have this like wide heel or whatever that's called like sole i don't know i don't know heel terminologies i need to think of that but they have this wide part though at the bottom and i feel like that definitely gives you like more comfort um when wearing the shoe the shoes are cheap and I feel like you can tell if you're like up close, but for picture's sake, I think that these would be cute. That's the bottom if you guys just want to like check it out. And like I said, they fit really comfortable and they are black. So you can really wear this like whenever. It doesn't even have to just be for summer. You can wear these in the fall. You can wear these in winter. You can wear this when spring comes back around. Like I feel like you can wear these whenever. So that's the beauty of black okay so these are the next heels that i got um they are these white little kind of like sandal heels i think that's what they call them now they're like sandal heels because they don't really have a strap where you were at the the ankle would be so it's pretty much going to be like a sandal how a sandal is but yeah i got these little like heeled sandals in white i know y'all have seen these on instagram there's no way you didn't see them on instagram yet like these are literally all over instagram 
all over Instagram, all over Instagram. Like, that's all I ever see. So, of course, I had to join the wave and get on board with the onboard. And <laughs> so, I went ahead and I picked up these heels right here. These are the Toe Post Stiletto Heel Mules. And these are in a size 7 and a half, which is a European 39, according to Shein. And um, I like these. I really do like them. The only thing with these are, they are just a little bit too big for me. So, um, if you are watching this... Don't get your size. Um, you need to definitely like size down. So I think I should have got a seven instead of maybe even a six and a half. Like, yeah, I should have sized down though for sure because these are just big and it just I hate when something just doesn't fit right. Like some people, it's like oh you know like it's it's okay, but to me I'm just like oh because that means I have to like you know reorder it or find another shoe and I just really hate going through that process. Like I just take that L and go to sleep like but these are a little bit too big for me however these are very cute they do look like their photo which is of course nice because we hate a scammer you know what i'm saying so um these are how they look though they're pretty long i thought yeah these are some long ass shoes like for real these are long when i saw them i'm like whew, i could just tell that they were going to be a little bit too big for me they look cute though like i really love this part um, and I do think that if they were my size, they would definitely be comfortable because like I said, nothing goes right here by your ankle. It's just literally open and free form. It just doesn't fit me the correct way. It's just a little bit too big. And like I said, that does bother me a bit because why, why you can't fit, why you can't fit how I want it to fit? You know, like why can't it be what I want it to be? Like that just really upsets me but um they're cute though for real like but take it from me like these are they these do definitely run big so you want to um size down but i would recommend them heavily if you get the right size if you get the right size if you get the right size but let me continue so these are the next heels that i have these are some wedges actually Ooh, and that just hit me in the face but these are some wedges so i decided to kind of just take it take it back like take it back a little bit you know i just kind of i just had to you know run it back like with the wedges like i love wedges i think wedges are so cute i think they scream femininity like yeah i love them i love them so much like especially with like a pair of shorts or something like that like that's what i'm envisioning for them like a pair of shorts you know like how the white moms be dressing like on vacation or you know for the beach they be having on their wedges with their little shorts or their skirts like the only thing about these wedges is that the strap is kind of complicated to figure out and so um yeah these are kind of complicated but i'm going to show you guys right now how to do it because i'm just that nice and i just like to help so basically you know this is like the part where you're gonna have your ankle at so boom and then you know usually to strap it this side this little buckle right here would be already right there but it's not so it's already attached to the strap the buckle and it has the holes so if you have to adjust it then you would just take it out as you would normally do take it out boom take out that little uh whatever hole picker you know the thing to pick the hole you want take out that and then put it in the hole that you want boom i already have it in the hole that i want so i'm gonna put it back in there and then you have this little weird part so your foot's gonna be in it of course but you just take this and you put that you see how it has like an opening right there you put it on there so i'm really trying to show y'all but you just put it on there so you're sliding exactly where the buckle is at onto that piece like that and you just slide it all the way and I slide it more upwards to where the um little hole picker is at. That's how I did it. And boom. And it's stuck. So that's how you do it. It's just like the best way that I could describe it. And I'm going to just show y'all how it looks. Yeah, so I would definitely recommend these if you also like wedges. I know it's still some wedges lovers out there. Like, I know it is. Y'all might be in the shadows. But I know y'all there. So, yeah, I love them. So, Hey. all right let's go to the next shoe okay so these are the next pair of heels um i really got these because i really thought that they were very different from anything that i have already like in my closet and i really tried to get different styles of heels because i feel like i always get like the same heels every day 
So when I saw these, I was like, ooh, these are super cute. I feel like this kind of like braided pattern definitely screams summer. I don't know, it's just something about braided patterns that just have like a summery vacation vibe to it that I cannot explain at all. And these are in the color apricot, which I don't have anything that is apricot at all. So I thought that that was definitely different and interesting. These are called the um, braided stiletto heel mules these are a very comfortable pair of heels i think you guys will also find them very comfortable oh and these are also a six and a half if you guys are wondering which is a european size 37 so you do have to size down with these shoes because again my my regular shoe size is a seven and a half and these are a six and a half so i sized down a whole size but these came in apricot which is the one i got right here and then they also came in white so yeah if you guys want um these shoes if you like the style but like you want them in white instead they have them in white so you guys should definitely go check it out once again all the links will be in the comments below but but yeah if you guys want these like in a like different color they definitely have them on the site so make sure you guys just go check out the website or whatnot but um yeah these were extremely comfortable on me i have zero complaints from these heels i really don't have anything really to nitpick over with these like i really think that these are like a really nice pair of heels and they were super comfortable in their cute in their summer vibes the only thing is you just have to size down so please do not forget that you guys you cannot get your regular size you do have to size down at least a half size i think i definitely think these will be able to go with like pretty much anything because they do kind of have like a nude like look to them so yeah i think that's really good so these would be a shoe if you want like a shoe that'll go with like anything then i would definitely say that these are them for sure because they look very like neutral toned heels so yes Okay, so the next pair of shoes that I have are some sandals. They are these black quilted faux leather square toe sandals in a size seven and a half. And I got these a long old time ago, but I'm just now getting to actually reviewing them for y'all. And um, yeah, these are these really like uh, trendy like square toe sandals. I know y'all have been seeing them. Um, I started seeing them first with Des Dior, um, which is like Jada's best friend, Jada Weta or whatever. I saw her with these like square toe sandals and I was like, oh my God, like I gotta get some because they are so cute. And so I did and I really, really, really love them a lot. The fit is a little bit weird. Like if you've never like had this type of like design or whatever, it does kind of feel a little weird, but like you get used to it like as you wear it but i don't have any complaints um they do just feel a little bit weird i can't remember if they slide over my um foot but let me just see okay so they don't so these pretty much stay behind the edge of the shoe which is good news of course because again i hate when shoes i myself i hate when shoes slide over the edge and then your toes just all hanging out they touching on the flow Especially after you just got them done like that is so annoying. So I'm so glad that I um, Got these and they are not like that. So she and you did good on that tip. You did good But um, yeah, these are black. These will go with anything in your closet These are also sandals. So these will be very 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 comfortable and they're also like cool to it right there So these are seven and a half. So they are true to size So if you are trying to get these then I would say just go ahead and get your size um, or you can even size down maybe if you're scared that these look a little bit too long I definitely think you can slide down but don't size down too much because then this part right here will be too tight So just keep that in mind like you don't want this part to be too tight and uncomfortable So yeah, these are them and we're gonna move on to the purses because I got some purses to show y'all So one of the first purses that I got from Shein was this cute little brown um, bag right here that you guys have seen um, I got these to go with the little crop print alligator heels that I got that I showed you guys earlier. This is a pretty cute bag though. Um, here is how it looks on the inside. Just to give you guys like an idea. There goes my phone. But just to give y'all like an idea of how it looks on the inside. There's nothing in it and there's no pockets or anything to put, you know, like, you know, stuff inside. Like it's just space. Like it's just a very open space in there. It also comes with a strap that is stuck in this paper. Um, I don't know what the strap is for, but I guess I'll figure that out. I thought that the gold little plastic fake chain that it comes with is also cute. And yeah, I think it'll be cute for pictures and pictures only because it, it like seeing it in person, you can definitely tell that the quality is, you know, on the cheaper side, but it looks cute for pictures, I think. So that's why I went ahead and I got this because I literally 
don't have a round purse in this bag literally only cost me like six or seven dollars so if you're trying to get like a bag or whatever i definitely would recommend this one it's brown so i definitely think that it is like summer material so yeah i also got a white bag pretty similar to the brown one it's a little different though this one is called ruched chain satchel bag and that one was called chain handle ruched bag which is basically the same thing in different words but here it is though it's like the basically the exact same thing it has this little print in the front and then nothing in the back and it's also kind of like you know ruched it had that ruching going on i haven't opened this one up yet though but i see that it is the exact same um as the brown purse so like i said it's pretty much the same thing i just got it in white because i want a white purse there's also nothing inside it as far as pockets so it's just open space which is cool not a big deal this is just a picture purse you know this is white so i also think that this is very much so summer appropriate you know this is definitely something you could take on like vacation with you um if you're trying to live your bad and bougie summer 2021 life then here you go. Yeah, I like this one a lot though, and I can't wait to take pictures with both of them. Cause I think that they're really be like cute little additions for the pictures, like. Okay, and then here is the next one. We got this round handle straw bag right here. Um, this one is just summer to a T. Uh, I know y'all have been seeing this little like trend with like the circle uh, handles and then the straw. I know y'all been seeing it, and here it is. I got it. I really like this one though. I think this is super cute. I, I wish I was going on some tropical vacation to where I could take pictures with this, but bitch, I ain't going tropical nowhere except Florida, which is where I already am. But yeah, either way though, it's cute. I like it and I think I definitely think you guys will like it yourselves it doesn't have a zipper if you guys are wondering so you can't zip the bag up like in the middle but yeah it also has this like handle so you guys can you know have it on your shoulder which i like because you know you don't always want to have to carry it you know in your hand all the time it's, it's kind of skinny though if you guys are wondering just like how thick it is it's kind of on the skinny side but i think you can make it thick if you actually have stuff in here so but yeah, it's cute though. I think it's really cute. I cannot wait to like wear this. It might have to be next summer too, cause I'm really not going to wear like this summer. Like, so <laughs> I don't know. But anyways, I thought it was cute, and I wanted to go ahead and add this to this collection and show you guys how it looks. So yeah. Well, anyways, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching my haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I know this might have seemed like a little quick because I was kind of like speaking through the items. Um, I really hope that I get to like really explain to you guys like what I got, show you guys how what you know I got and everything. And I really hope that y'all saw some things that y'all liked and want to get for yourself. Like I said, all the links to these items will be in the description box below. So make sure you guys check them out. As well as my social medias, my Poshmark. And um, don't forget to um, subscribe if you are new. If you are a returning supporter. Thank you guys so much for watching me. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye you guys.